Good morning. You know, today, well, it's not going to be quite as pretty as yesterday. I hope that you were able to enjoy the really beautiful weather that we had on Sunday. Today is going to feature a whole lot more clouds and some rain showers, too. I wanted to start off and show you a zoomed in look. This is our local radar. You can see this one little band of a couple of spotty showers that develop and then kind of fade out across the area. So you may be getting a few initial showers in a few spots in Dade County, Walker County, even over into southern portions of Murray County. Uh, but that's it that's showing up right now. Let's pull back farther. I'm going to show you more of a national look and you can really see the batch of rain that's crossing over from Mississippi into western Alabama at this time. These are the rain showers that are really going to move into our area. So again, I think that the most widespread rain is going to happen between about 8 a.m. and 1 p.m. So let's go ahead and take a look at future cast as that rain is pushing in. Here is about 8 a.m. But notice for the rest of the morning, even some pockets of some heavy downpours will be possible. So especially if you're not going to be heading out until 9, 10 o'clock this morning, uh, the roads are going to be wet at that point. Also wet roads for your lunch break too. Now, once we get past 1 o'clock, we will still have some scattered showers this afternoon. You can still see some green showing up on the map, but they're going to be just that scattered. So not as widespread of rain as it will deal with for the morning time. And then by evening, by about 6 o'clock, showers are going to be tapering off and then overnight dry conditions. Now overnight, there will still be the potential for some patchy fog and mostly cloudy skies. I do want to take you to Tuesday morning, so this is 9 a.m. on Tuesday. Wind will continue from the south tomorrow, but notice how clouds gradually decrease. So you're going to get more sunshine as we head into Tuesday afternoon. Any of those glimpses of sun, of course, are going to help those temperatures warm up. Tomorrow will be a lot warmer, so highs today in the low 60s. Tomorrow, highs are going to be in the upper 70s to low 80s. As we look ahead to Wednesday, more of that warmth. So a couple of spotty showers possible both Tuesday and Wednesday during the daytime. Really no big deal. In fact, you're still going to have some sunshine mixed in for your Wednesday too, as highs will climb up into the mid 80s. So a really warm day on Wednesday with that southerly breeze. Now focus back on today. Total rainfall today on average a quarter to three quarters of an inch. We could see a little bit higher totals than that for our far southern communities with some of those heavier downpours. Let's go a little bit more long term. So this is going to be Wednesday evening. You're going to notice this cold front approaching our area. Now, the main severe risk for Wednesday into Thursday is going to be outside of our region, but we still have a low in chance as this cold front passes Wednesday night into Thursday for triggering not only showers, but yes, some storms. That'll be something that we'll watch. That rain is going to continue kind of on and off through the day on Thursday. Temperatures at that point will be a little bit cooler as well. This morning, we have quite the spread across the area. Again, cooler to the east, 41 degrees right now versus 56 in Altamont, 51 currently in Chattanooga. Going through the day today, rainy conditions really for the first half of the day, but even into the afternoon, still dealing with some scattered showers, 60 degrees at three o'clock, 60 by 6 p.m. with those showers tapering off. I think we'll top out at a 62 for your high gusts around 20 miles per hour today. Tonight, 56, mostly cloudy with some patchy fog, and then tomorrow, 82 with decreasing clouds. So more afternoon sunshine will be possible. Here's the full seven day forecast. So today, certainly a soggy day. Just have the raincoat, the umbrella tomorrow, very slim chance of that 10% and really the 30% on Wednesday comes into play more Wednesday night. So much of Wednesday is going to be dry too. That you get to enjoy that high of 85 degrees.